Manufacturing engineering is a discipline of engineering where students learn about all the facets involved with manufacturing a, prod a product. Um, processes, materials, um, flow, all of that till the product comes out the other end. The students learn many things in the manufacturing pathway here at Woodville Tompkins. They'll be learning things about electricity and electronics, pneumatics, uh, possibly some hydraulics. They'll become a, a very familiar at one point in the program with robotics and automated systems, things like computer numeric control and programmable logic controllers. They'll be building robots to solve problems and manufacturing products. The training that they receive at Woodville Tompkins will help Savannah manufacturers in lots of ways. Um, our biggest economic industry in Savannah right now is manufacturing, and there is a a big shortage for engineers in general as well as people coming out with the skills like CNC, um, PLC, pneumatics, electronics to help support these factories and the equipment in the factories. Um, Savannah Technical College also has programs that support that and we're hoping that we can feed right into that and develop these skills to support those manufacturers. All right, one of our projects uh, I decided to try a long time ago was the Hovercraft. I visit one of the uh, companies that uh, we buy all our stuff from Amatrol and they gave us a tour of a hovercraft and I was so amazed at that so when I got back I said this is the first thing we're going to do, we're going to do one of those projects. So we um, developed a hovercraft and on this day we tried it and it worked. So that was one of them and the students take ownership in that because they had to make the diagram, they had to outline it, we had to get all the materials together and we also had to go by the directions. The robotics and automated systems equipment that we have is going to help the community in the fact that the factories of the future are largely going to be automated with robots doing a lot of work. Um, it changes the workforce uh, from the type of people that we have down on the shop floor now to be people skilled in programming, maintaining those pieces of equipment, troubleshooting those pieces of equipment. So all of the training for people is going to have to change to keep these factories up and going. If we want to encourage manufacturers to come to Savannah with these automated systems, we have to show that we are workforce ready. And one of the ways to show that we're workforce ready is by starting to train them here at Woodville Tompkins and then allowing them the opportunity to go get some technical training at Savannah Technical College in addition to what we're doing here and that should give us a good workforce ready uh, group of people for those industries. Being that we're a port city and we're one of the few port cities along the eastern seacoast, we will always be a large manufacturing area. There will always be jobs for manufacturers, manufacturing engineers. We are the only program in the area at the high school level that is offering a manufacturing engineering program. So in order for students to come out and have a job, a skill that they can go right to work for, or to develop some foundation to become manufacturing engineers, come back here and stay in this community and support these manufacturers, this is the place to come. Uh, my name is Ben Fontenot. Uh, right now I'm working on the CNC mill in Mr. Robinson's class. Right now what I've done, I've uh, put in the paths for the CNC mill to pretty much simply type in my name. I can tell it whatever to do and it will carve into this piece, which is a, right now it's a piece of just plastic. Uh, right now I have all the, all the coordinates to type in my name. After that, uh, pretty much all I have to do is just make sure nothing goes wrong and if so, I have the registry stop button to, to, to correct what I've done wrong. Great school, I definitely recommend it to anybody that's uh, taken the career track uh, during high school. It would help out tremendously.